welcome to the video. We've got some wheels here. This is all from Facebook Marketplace. All of them are purchased from legitimate cyclists. Nothing stolen here. And uh, this is a wheel set. Here's a DT Swiss wheel set die cut. Really good condition. Came with tyres in there. Had a good chat with the guy as well. Near new. $250 Australian. Came with a, an old Tegel cassette on there as well. On almost near new as well. A near new cassette there. So 11 speed Tegra. So we've got front and rear. We'll put it over here on the on the uh, pile there. So that's the front and rear wheel. Look at that. Look, look how mint condition that is. So you can see the braking surface. Fantastic. And the tyres. What's that? We've got a tyre with a on there, you know? No cuts and nicks. Amazing. 250 bucks. Even come with quick releases. That's a DT Swiss die cut. Bearings perfect. We've got a Rovar wheel here. This came also with a cassette. The front wheel got toasted. The vehicle's fine. It's got a Durace cassette on there. Really good condition. And we've got this for 120 bucks, and it's got a Conti tire in there as well. The rim, it's um, it's got plenty of life left in it. It has had a bit of usage. The bearings in here are ceramic. Little, mm, probably about, mm, I'd say about a nine out of ten, eight, eight and a half out of ten bearing quality there. But plenty of life left. So that's the Roval there. It's a Rapid CLX40. All right. So, and the rim quality. It's had a little bit of life, but it's still got plenty of life left in there. What else have we got next up? We've got a Bontrager Race. Also had a, a great yarn uh, with the seller. Got this off Gumtree. Cyclist, Adelaide Cyclist here. The rim brakes, great condition. These were, I put some tyres in there. Some tyres I got for like five or ten bucks from someone else. They come with quick releases. Uh, these are Bontrager Race, which I rate. is a good little wheel there. Bearing quality, fantastic. These come off uh, his lady's Domane. So plenty of life left in those. Got them for a hundred bucks front and rear. The, the front's somewhere in my other wheel stash. I've got a lot of wheels. I just can't help myself. I don't know. I just, I just, I can't help myself sometimes. These wheels here, this came in a pair as well for about 120 maybe. They're like a $900 wheel set back in the day. Accelerates. They're like a, uh, it's like a Kinlin rim maybe in a Bitex hub. How they roll. Very smooth. Very, very nice. Very, very nice. So disc brakes have killed rim brakes. Rim brakes are dead. Rim brakes are dead, but I still prefer them on the road. This one here was a, a rear wheel. I think this was like 20 or 30 dollars, I think. You know, um, still good. Is a reasonably worn rim, but a great backup if some, one of my mates or someone needs a, just a wheel for 20 or 30 bucks. We can we can give them this one. It's got a little Michelin Mega Meal on there. Remember those tires in 1999? Fantastic, classic. Go over here, we have a Sirium. This is, a, this is a disc one, all right? This is one of the new ones. Looks like Mavic take note in my videos, hopefully. That sounds legit. The free hub body, look at that. It's almost DT Swiss quality. Bearing's perfect. Um, this, I put this tire on there. Remember these Michelin Axial Pro lights? It's old school. This one is great condition. It did have the rider, he hit a curve on there somewhere. And it does have a little a little bend, um, which I was, I'm fine with, um, but he wasn't. Uh, so you just sold it 50 bucks great guy bit of a deal with a spider we'll move that little spider in the bush shortly but there was like a little bit of a, a little bit of a ding in it um, pretty marginal for me but again it's just and it's a one off wheel so it's, it's just things you know that don't sell that well if they're just one offs unfortunately even but a seagull like me will we'll pick them up and this we have here is a, a DT Swiss three, a 350 hub set 350 straight pull hub set bearings very decent. The rim as well. This is looks like a fast sports. It's very thick. It's very wide. So this was 150 for the pair. A triathlete, local rider, just upgraded to disc brakes. So these rim brakes were just collecting dust. And so 150 for the pair. We can ponk them on here. And I basically just bought these wheels for the videos. And this is the rear. Look at that. Look at that. Um, 11 speed. But again, rim brakes is not worth anything, is it? You know. Yeah. Feels, feels, feels legit. I love DT Swiss because you can service them and uh, the bearings, you can pop them in and out. So you put ceramics in there, whatever. Rim, rim wear, it's got, a, it's got a bit of wear in it, but it's got a lot left. It's got a lot left. And it's got, what's the spokes got in here? Maybe some sappins or some DT Swiss with straight pull there. So yeah, 150 bucks. Can't complain. Um, yeah, w nice wide rim. I've got a pretty thick thumb and thick um, yeah, it works you know, pretty good there. So it's got a little, little rattle in there. We'll take care of that for a little bit of a bit of carbon chunked off. You've got a Durace wheel. 
50 bucks. <laughs> 50 bucks, mate. 50 bucks. So it's like, um, yeah, interesting times. It, you know, this is, you get a lot of corrosion here, but it's just cosmetic. It's just cosmetic, you know. But people don't want to buy it, it's just a single wheel often, so, you know. But for me, these wheels are fantastic, right? Look at this condition. Look at that. This is hardly done any miles. Fantastic, fantastic tyre as well. Can't complain. It's a 24 mil. That's pretty rare, isn't it? 24. Hub bearings, perfect. Like, just feels, this This is, feels like a brand new wheel. It's got even a Jure skewer in there, which I, I do rate. Not super light, but they're very reliable. Good skewer. Um, tyre as well. I've got plenty left on that tyre. So that's just me. I, I, I couldn't even help myself. There's just so many deals out there. You can build yourself up a really, really nice bike here in Adelaide, Australia for $1,000. Um, if, you, if you're willing to put in the time and talk with people and a bit of a haggle with a barter and, and not be too much of a douche about it, but there's people out there who just go, yeah, just take it. Just 50 bucks, give me 150 bucks, whatever, just take it, you know. And so there's deals that are out there. They do take a bit of work, but I just, I know I like talking to people and had a bit of a, a, a bit of a blabber there, but, um, and giving things a second home, you know. I just, I pass it, I sell these on uh, to friends, cost price or whatever. I generally just a bit of a, a bit of a, a cupid. I set people up together or I, connect bikes and wheels for people i just can't help myself and um i love it man i love adelaide facebook marketplace gumtree legitimate sales cycling community here is, is uh, pretty awesome in terms of deals getting passed around and uh, there you go so that's what stuff is worth here adelaide australia <laughs> you want to check a monda frame what's it, what's, it, what's it worth what's it, what's this a monda frame worth 20 bucks you know what i mean there's no headset there's no fork what's it worth 20 bucks maybe 20 30 bucks give me 30 bucks you can have it anyway that's the deal Thanks for watching.